My name is Yalak Buru. I have the pleasure of serving as President and Chief Executive Officer of the International Myeloma Foundation, but I am also a 28-year myeloma patient. The IMF has been intentional in making progress towards finding the cure. In one short sentence, what we aspire to do is find the cure for myeloma patients. And our goal is for myeloma patients not to die of myeloma by 2035. Both in the area of cure and prevention, we are really making solid, active progress. Two attempted cure trials have been completed right now. One in Spain, the CSER trial, 90% of the patients in this uh, study are doing well. In a second CURE trial conducted in the U.S., the ASCENT trial, 84% of the patients have achieved an MRD negative status, in this case out to three years. The research is integral because everybody wants to live longer, that they can have a better quality of life, that they can see their kids, their grandkids, grow and thrive and be successful. So CURE is at the forefront of all of our efforts. At the IMF, we are working on issues of health equity, health disparities, and ensuring access so that we can address the unmet needs of patients around the world. The Empower Project of Myeloma is really having a tremendous impact. It's having an impact in community engagement as we seek to engage the African-American community and have people understand how it disproportionately affects the African-American community. And so the impact now that we've measured is seen in the number of communities that we've touched, the way in which people have been educated about myeloma and its timely diagnosis, and indeed improving the care and access of our patients for multiple myeloma. And that's really what we've been seeking to do and what we've been achieving. The goal is simple. Educate the patient, provide knowledge, provide understandings of research and advocacy and support, the four pillars of the International Myeloma Foundation. At the IMF, we work on public policy at the federal level as well as the state level. On the research side, we work to ensure that federally funded research is robust for myeloma, and that's something I'm really proud of that the IMF has accomplished is to get myeloma-specific research through the DOD that wasn't there before the IMF, so I'm really proud of that. I think the biggest policy changes that we hope to see are issues surrounding access. A lot of them are things like step therapy, prior authorization, and it could, it could delay your care, so we want to make sure people have timely care. We are advocating on behalf of our myeloma community to decision makers, ensuring that there are appropriate and accurate policies that are being put on place. But how do we also give them the voice? How do we empower them with the voice to speak out for themselves and for others like them in the community? There is no more powerful tool than the patient voice in sharing their experience, their lived experience, and sharing their story to really compel our policymakers to best understand and make decisions on behalf of patients. The Medical Student Scholars for Health Equity and Multiple Myeloma, I think has been one of the most exciting projects we have within the umbrella of Empower. This program was designed to recruit 12 minority medical students and pair them with myeloma experts to do a project in health disparities. And many of these projects have now turned into abstracts that have been accepted at large meetings like the American Society of Hematology and will inevitably make their way towards manuscripts. We are a nonprofit organization and everything and anything that we are able to do in research, advocacy, support and education is only possible because of support. You stepping up in this moment when it is most acutely needed could save a life. If not today, someday down the line. I really want to ask you to help the myeloma community. I'm really looking to you for that support. Join us and improve the lives of myeloma patients. Join us and advocate with us. Join us in this battle as we seek to change the course of myeloma, reduce these disparities, and improve the quantity and quality of life of all patients with myeloma. Join us in our mission to improve the quality of life of myeloma patients while working towards prevention and acute.